So, freeze for five, five years, the budget. Just don't add any net dollars. No net dollars, okay? So, if a Republican president, or a Republican Congress, or a Republican Senate, or all three of the above, can figure some things out, cut the fat, shore up the good stuff, but keep the dollar amount flat the same. The next thing, freeze for five. All legal and illegal immigration. You heard me right. Both legal and illegal immigration needs to be frozen for five years. The reason why is because we need a census audit of how many, that is the total of all illegals, currently in the United States. The 11 million is sorely low, my friends. If we gave amnesty to 11 million people, we'd have 45 million people, or 25 million people, or 12 million people apply. What would happen if 12 million applied? There's only 11 million spots? No, everybody gets it. So we need to audit the amount of illegals we have that way we can determine if we can figure out and how fast we can figure out how to actually integrate them into American society. You know, you know what I'm talking about, you know, speaking English, going to school, staying off the streets, not being a gang member, perhaps getting a job and paying taxes, that kind of thing. That's fantastic and that's what we need. But before we can do that, we have to freeze for five all immigration and all illegal immigration, meaning that we can't start my plan, freeze for five, until the border's secure. Obviously, as soon as that border's secure, zzz, zipper right down, we're talking zero entrance. Zero illegal entrance. We can start the plan. The next thing on the list is freeze for five or eliminate within five. But we want to freeze, at the very least, all the regulations and burdensome rules and laws associated with the Affordable Care Act, Obamacare. We can't handle it. Nobody can handle it. You can't handle it. I can't handle it. Here's why. Nobody knows this. It's ridiculous. Family of four gets Obamacare. Full subsidy. So the family's paying three twelve a month. Normally they'd pay nine sixteen a month, but they're getting, you know, Six hundred dollars, six hundred and four dollars in subsidy, so they're paying three twelve. And this is first hand. So I know this from first hand, but it's not me, obviously, because I don't have a family. But here's the deal. They have a twelve thousand dollar deductible. Twelve thousand dollar deductible. Each and every year they've been alive on the planet, neither of them have ever spent twelve thousand dollars in one particular year on health care. But now in order to actually get their Obamacare and actually have the coverage kick in. And what I mean by coverage, folks, is I like to use the word folks because it's begun being used primarily, you know, in about 2008, 2009. It's a great number to uh, appeal to the audience. But what we got here, folks, is a good old-fashioned robbery taking place. 